Uh, thank you, Mr. Chairman. I want to thank the witnesses for being here today. Uh, let me follow up, uh, Mr. Work, on the question that Senator Blumenthal asked you with regard to BRAC. And uh, I would like you to give us a commitment uh, that the Department of Defense will not undertake BRAC uh, without the approval of Congress and will also not try to undertake BRAC through a workaround that undermines the will of Congress without seeking our approval for a BRAC round. Will you give me that commitment? Senator, as I understand the wording of the speech yesterday was that Secretary Hagel believes that there are some authorities that the Department could use, uh, but I don't know what the, those authorities are. And I commit to you that, if confirmed, I will work with both the Department to get back to you. Uh, and of course, we would not start a BRAC uh, unless we are given explicit uh, approval in the law. Well, I take that as a lack of commitment, um, and so that troubles me because I believe that Congress should be in the position to prove BRAC and that there should not be a runaround done. So that troubled me in the Secretary's comments yesterday, and I believe this is a very important issue for the authority of this committee in particular, that Congress should be the body to approve a BRAC round, uh, not for the Department of Defense to undertake this on its own initiative without the full approval of the Congress. So I do expect an answer on that, and I would like to know from the Secretary in particular what authority he believes he does have so that we can be aware of it here so that we can exercise appropriate authority um, to make sure that our voices are heard here on the policy matters. So I think this is a very important issue. I would like a follow-up answer to that. Yes, ma'am. Thank you.